Hey guys, welcome to the stream. Views from the Vault 89. Uh, this week in caps, uh, Jason, Leon, and Pierre here. Uh, if you guys are in the chat, please drop a like. Let us know you're here in the comments. We got some exciting stuff happening. Discord link. Hope everyone's enjoying their Friday. Brian Strain, first commenter. How you doing? What's up? All right. Josh Babbitt, what's up, buddy? Donovan? What's up, Babbitt? Leon, do you want to um, enter it into our into the Discord? Yes. With a little add everyone action. A little add everyone. We are live. All right, Got a lot of people pop in here, which is cool. Love it. What's up, Kyle? What's up, TDWP018? <laughs> Vito's here. Matt, God, we got a lot of people in here. Danny's in here. All right. I don't know. It energizes me when there's a lot of people in the uh, in the chat. I love it. I love it. Yeah. We have very exciting news at the end of our show, so make sure you guys are tuned in at the end. Mm-hmm. Or at least till the end. Yep. Everything in the middle will be important too, right? <laughs> yeah, and the uh the views in the vault conglomerate is taking over. Yeah. It's everywhere now. We got the hat crawler, we got honorable mention, we've got a Discord, we've got an Instagram, we've got a YouTube, and gosh, what's next? TikTok. Leon's gonna be TikToking. Pinterest. Pinterest. I'm just talking crap. Uh, cooking channel. I'm not an 80 year old. I'm not a. I'm not a 40 uh, year old housewife. So there's not gonna be any Pinterest for me. Vlogging. We'll, we'll get the RV revved up with vinyl. The wrap. Discord, dude. I don't know, Jason. If if you if if you're seeing what I'm seeing, but that Discord is crazy. You yeah. go in there. It is. Every it time is. you're in there, it's like loaded with comments. Yeah, the general the general thread is probably the most popular one, right? That one in the hat of the day. No, it ebbs call. and flows, man. It yeah. ebbs and flows. After you see a hat club drop or before a hat club drop, that one's going nuts. Then same thing with toppers. Lids has been going nuts. I just added uh, some sneaker channels, too. I added uh, Nike Talk, Adidas Talk, um, New Balance Talk. Um, yeah. Yeah, as soon as, like, uh, – a vendor drops some like leak picks or anything like they, they go right up in there. So if you guys are uh, looking to communicate with the rest of the community, it's going to be hard to do without getting into that discord. So we do advise getting in there and then turning off the notifications in general, and then just turning them on for what you want to talk about. Hey, Don, welcome. Behave yourself today. Don Carrera. <laughs> Don't you make me. Don't you make me silence you in that chat today, Don Carrera. I'm watching you. <laughs> and we also have uh, a lot of uh, different verified store representatives, too. So you can get some pretty direct links uh, to some Listen, stores, too. Liz HD said, Liz HD and what we talked through last night with, the, with Britain was fantastic. Man, that's probably one of my favorite episodes. Mm -hmm. You know? That was fun. It was, man. It was good. It was good stuff, man. I'm excited to see what happens, man. Yeah, Nano, he was. Uh, Britain was in the uh, Discord again today. We also got Tom K, who's in the Discord. He's uh, mm -hmm. he's 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 way up there in the new era world, um, mm -hmm. new era cap style. Uh, um, you know, he's 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 been around, man. He's been around, so he was there. We got a lot of stuff shop. going on in there. Fourth quarter mm -hmm. shop just joined. 
Yep, fourth quarter shot. Shout out to Eric. Yep. Man, it's going to be great, man. I, I absolutely uh, – uh, yeah, Ty Mathis is going in there and dropping things in the Stash 1250 uh, chat, like letting people know about drops and whatnot. And the pin stuff is fantastic, man. You got you got Ronnie Fitted's in there, you know. You got mm. all the usual suspects. You got, you got the best people in the pin world in there too. Mr. Stay um, Humble. Oh, I love that guy. I love yeah. that guy. I met him when I went out to uh, NoHo. Um, nice. For their store reopening. And what a great dude, man. What a great dude. All right. Jason, are you um are you good or do you need a few more minutes there? No, I, I'm ready to go whenever you guys are. All right, let's do it. All right, let's get started. Oops. Hold on a sec. My screen just disappeared. There you go. Hey guys, welcome to the vault. It is episode 89 this week in caps. Um, glad to have you guys with us. Um, you got the usual suspects, Leon, Jason, and Pierre. Hope you guys enjoy. Pierre, take it away. All right. Well, good evening, everyone, and welcome to this week in caps, episode 89. It's crazy. We're we're almost at we gotta do something special for the hundredth episode, right? I think so. We're gonna do something special. Centennial but gosh, episode. man. Yeah, so I want to start, if it's okay, talking about uh, the Discord. Um, you know, listen, I gotta be, t- I gotta be honest with you guys. This is this is the future right here. Of you, you know, the YouTube is always going to be here, and it's fantastic. But the best companion to this YouTube and all the different things that the three of us do is definitely that Discord. Um, and you can see it's getting bigger and bigger. We're already at eleven hundred. Uh, um, uh, members and that that's a, up a hundred from from yesterday right so each day we're piling on another 75 to 100 people and that we're not even like in that whole um disco- discovery phase yet where it can just be discovered by searching and that's going to happen in another uh six weeks because we we're we only two weeks old yeah not even <laughs> which is insane we're not we because it started i think i started it later in the day on a sunday yep so it's not even it's like 12 days old so just impressive growth. And it's been, it's been absolutely fantastic. Um, I don't know, man, I can't, I can't say enough about how much I love it. I've been, um, listen, I, I, I've been watching the chat. I've been trying to figure out, is there anything different we can do? Add more stuff, go into that suggestion box, right? If you think there's something else we should do, if you think like we can clean it up by adding a different channel to kind of create great streams of conversation that don't kind of blend into one another, let me know. I'll go in there and add it. Um, yeah, I'm I'm ready to I'm ready to just take this to the next level with uh with Jason and Leon, and I know you all are too. So if you haven't joined yet, um, Leon is pinned uh pinned at the top of the chat uh, the link to get in there. And listen, I'm I'm gonna share a couple little tidbits, right? So there will be I'm 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 a hundred percent sure we're gonna have exclusive drops on Discord, meaning I'm gonna reach out to some uh, to some stores and say, listen, this hat right here. I, I want this to drop on Discord first. Like I want, I want the announcement on Discord first, and maybe I can get Jason Me to not post it, so it's exclusively in Discord, right? Um, maybe I can coerce Jason into one, you know, one hat here or there to not post, so I can have it exclusively released on Discord. Yeah, I wouldn't. Um, I, w- I wouldn't want to curse it. That's for sure. What's that? I wouldn't want to curse that hat. That's for sure. So. Uh, we're going to get there in a second. We're going to get there in a second. Calm down, big yeah. fella. So <laughs> I'm a, so there, we're going to have some real exclusive stuff going on. You've got to get on this Discord because I'm going to make it worth your while. I promise you. Now, I want to get into this thing. I've been hearing a lot of stuff out there about um, some negative talk. And, and listen, man, I, I'm protective. I, I consider uh, I consider uh, Leon and Jason like uh, little brothers to me. Um, so I want to be clear about something. I, I saw this talk about, you know, Jason is a curse or whatever. He's messing up the Let me tell you something. I, I think right now you're looking at the three hardest working guys in hats that have other jobs, right? So it's, it's, I just want to kind of throw that out there. So this is all done. Really. We're not, we're not, I want to be honest with you. We're not making any, any legit money here. Like this is like basically every dime we make gets put back into the show or the discord or whatever, whatever, whatever. Right. And mm-hmm. you know, the only thing we did that was pleasurable to be honest with you was go out to Buffalo together. Um, and that was, that was actually put back into the channel because that was for the channel. 
So mm-hmm. I just want to be clear that, you know, we're, he, we're working hard. Um, and Rachel, if you don't like me, you can just get off the channel. Um, why don't you just kick her now? <laughs> kick All her right. out now. That'd be great. Bye, Rachel. So I just I'm want everyone you. to, uh, I, it was nice, nice, nice meeting you, Rachel. Um, and you know, I think, I think what we're, what we have to do is appreciate what we do have. And like guys like Jason and, and the work he does, um, is ultra important. And, um, and, you know, listen, uh, I know you're not a curse, Jason. I know how much work you put into this and you don't, <laughs> it's not a benefit to you, uh, more so it is to the community. So I want to kind of leave it at that and thank you, Jason, for all the work you do. Um, yeah, thank you. And with that, join that discord, but Leon, um, we're going to get started here. Is that okay with you? Are you okay with me? All right, let's do it. And uh, Rachel, I hope you have a nice evening. <laughs> Imagine coming to someone's channel and then getting mad that they're talking. <laughs> it's weird, right? Listen, Rachel, I don't, uh, I, I don't know you. I don't know you, but I'm pretty sure you're not actually Rachel. I don't know who that. Like, yeah. What was that about? You know. Uh, you hey, know, listen, I'm going to tune into you your channel. It's, it's like it's like going to a. a instagram channel that posts hats and complaining about them posting hats it's it's kind of weird yeah, what, do you think, what do you think i'm gonna do here like, right. gonna do here? hey guys you, let's you try to be silent enough. for three seconds let's be silent for three minutes and see what happens yeah exactly we're not doing that all right yeah. there you go that was a, definitely a fake account don career it's probably your account that's why he hadn't, he that's why he hadn't commented in the last 30 seconds. He had to switch yeah, back. Yeah. Yeah, Don, how come I couldn't see you and Rachel commenting at the same time? <laughs> that's a real question. <sighs> yeah, kick rocks, Rachel. All right, so let's get started everybody. We got we've got uh well, let's start with this, right? We got 70, 80 people in the room now, 45 likes, which is pretty good. But let's get that uh let's get that like number closer to that 80 number. And we're going to get started here at Bronx Social. So Bronx Social had a couple of releases. This Pittsburgh Pirates hat, two-tone with the yellow under, and this uh, colorful cub. What are you guys thinking here? Looks like a Spumoni restock. So we're going to hit the Spumoni from the original play show to Quan and uh, PBJ. I guess you can get it here. Oh, yeah. I mean, brown, pink. Exactly the same? Looks like it. Is it? I thought the Spumoni had more pink on the front, but I could be wrong. Um, yeah, brown and pink. Very popular color. Mm. All right. Let's move on to Anthem. At first, I was like, this is wild, and then it worked for me. I don't know about you guys, but I, I like this hat. It's not for everybody, but I'd love to hear your take on it. Leon, what are you thinking about this hat? I mean, you know me. I love my Blue Jay hats. Um, it is, it is, like you said, it's a bit different because I'm not used to, uh, the camo only being at the front and, uh, the visor, but, um, it is a slick hat. I mean, the, the side patch is just executed, um, really well, really pops off against that black. It looks like a, like a toasted peanut kind of color or some type of, uh, beige, but either way, it's, it's a slick hat and Dan doesn't release anything messy. So it kind of works. I, yeah. The craziest stuff he released that was most like kind of that was the most different was probably that hip hop pack, right? The rap icons. Uh maybe the mascots. Remember he did the mascots in kind yeah, of crazy those... colors? That'd probably be his yeah. like craziest oh, yeah, 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 that's right. that's stuff. Right. But uh yeah, this is still a fun hat. They haven't seen nothing yet. We got something coming with Anthem. Mm. But we'll leave it at that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, let's move let's move on to Sneaker Town. And I want to tell you all. Without getting too detailed here, we're going to have some cool previews coming from Sneaker Town pretty soon. Mm-hmm. Um, and I'm going to tell you, it's going to, it's going to, it's going to blow the roof off of this, this thing when you, when you see what we're talking about. Mm-hmm. But uh, for now, we've got this Kansas City Royals 40th anniversary with an icy blue bottom. Um, I think that was a, I think it's gray. Might be gray. Is it? It looks it's gray. Blue. It's, it? yeah, it, it is gray though. Yeah. Hmm. Must be a blue reflecting up there. It's but this is a great hat. Yeah. This is a clean. really good hat. Yeah. It's a clean hat. Yeah. They, and yeah. they did did a shock drop restock of the uh, Street Fighter pack. I saw that. And the uh, Icy Icy Braves. Mm. Yeah. So they were they were cleaning up the warehouse a little bit, making room for what we're about to show. <laughs> uh, yeah. In, in a couple of days. 
this is a very, very uh, simple hat, especially for Sneaker Town, right? This this has yeah. hat heaven written all over it. Yeah, doesn't feel, feel um, kind of Sneaker Town-ish with the normal, like, yeah. crazy off uh, two tones. But, you know, it's still a really nice hat. I, I definitely look to pick this one up. No, I like this hat. I do like this hat a lot. All right, so let's uh, let's move on, guys, to the hat club. Man, and I lo- I'm going to tell you guys, I like these things. These are good. I like these hats. The White Sox one is perhaps one of the worst hat club hats of the year. I want to be clear. Nah, that's not the worst hat club hat of the year. Oh, probably. God, dude, that thing is fucking terrible. And the Red Sox I mean, one it's, is it's, better. It's not, it's not the best one in this collection, but it's definitely not the worst uh, hat club hat. I think hat you meant to use the smaller logo hat on. I, I think he meant to use the smaller socks logo. But then the yeah, if you look at this twice. thing head on, Jason, if you look at it head on, that logo is like billboard sized. Yeah. Yeah. Still, I, it, it still beats almost every teal band land there was. Yeah, no, Donovan, I didn't cash out. I went with Braves, Orioles, Rockies, Red Sox, PBJ. I think there was another one too. Is there more more of these? Another yeah, there's slide? another slide. Yeah. All right. So right here, why don't we do this? I want to hear from all the viewers out there. Keep two, drop two, and Leon. I'm gonna start with you. Keep two, drop two. So I'm gonna go with uh, two that I want to keep, but I didn't buy, and I'm kind of regretting it. Uh, it's the Orioles and the Twins. Um, I don't know what I was thinking. Um, I ended up grabbing the Rockies in real life though to kind of match the NoHo exclusive one. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm with you, Pierre. I'm gonna drop the White Sox. I don't think it's the logo he intended to use. I think he wanted to use the smaller one, but here we are. And then the uh, Boston one um, is a victim of being a little. The patch is a victim of being a little bit washed. I think the the white and the pink don't play well together in in this. Instance. Well, I do like that they used 1986. That was different, mm-hmm. you know. But yeah, I don't know, man. It just the patch didn't come out uh, come out right, in my opinion. Jason, yeah. keep two, drop two. Uh, let's see. I will, uh, since you guys already said the Braves, Orioles, and Twins, I'm going to go a little different route. I'm going to keep that Brewers. Brewers is nice. Uh, yeah. Uh, and I'm going to keep the Dodgers. Okay. Right, with the little pink out, duh, triple outline there or double oh, outline. Oh, wow. Dodgers. Yeah, and that side patch is, is really nice. The curse um, has collected the Dodgers. <laughs> right, right. Uh, the the cancer that I am must be affecting my vision or something, but, um, <laughs> and I'm going to drop, uh, I'm going to drop the, the diamond backs. I just think there was better logo and, and, and side patch combos I could have used on this collection. And I'm going to drop the, the Indians. Okay. That might be one of the last times you can kind of see that, you know, uh, yeah. And those combos be- in action. Yeah, we're um, not going to be seeing Indians. Uh, the, they're going to be trickling up here. So, um, yeah. Yeah. So, I, 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 it's fine to grab it, but I'm just not a fan of that side patch, especially with in the, the three color combo that they used here. It looks good in that two tone off white they did. Mm-hmm. How you guys feel right, about the, uh, the next- a- a- how you feel about the Astros? I usually don't like that logo, but that one's pretty good. So, I don't care. Okay. It's okay. I, uh, in my old age, I'm starting to not like that side patch. Fair enough. All right, let's see the next slide. Yeah. Oh, okay. So the other ones I got were the Padres and Texas. Yeah, I grabbed Donovan. Texas. You were right. I got Texas, Donovan. You were right. And uh, the PBJ one. The PBJ one I had to get. The Cardinals one's really interesting because the birds are two different colors. I wish mm-hmm. I had gotten that one for that very reason. It was different. Yeah. 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 I didn't realize till it was too late as well. But uh, the standard PBJ one is, is super necessary. I wish they would include him on more of the drops. I think any any colorway that, that he creates. Just give him one, right? Yeah. Should have his hat included. Yeah. Because the Skull Chief, we've been there, done that. I love the Skull Chief, but come on, man. Yeah, yeah, I don't need to see any more of the skull chief. Um, I would like I'm, to see the, the 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 chief in the original form. That'd be pretty cool to mix that one in. 
I'm, I'm not a super fan of the size of the uh, back hit they put on the PBJ. What they do they would have made? It says a initial logo, but yeah. it's like it's like two inches tall. Wish they would have just cut that in half or something. But okay. that's nitpicking. That's nitpicking. Is it the same size as the original, Pierre? Do you know? I don't have mine in hand yet. Um, I don't, I don't know. I'm gonna take some good pictures of them tomorrow. Okay. I don't remember there being one on the, the original, but yeah, it's that monogram. Uh, Don yeah, Danny yeah. D- design that. So on the on the Good Hat site, I usually do like things we love over there. Yeah. So I'm gonna take um I'm gonna take his hats and that jersey and that helmet Ooh. and some of his pins and kind of do a good picture of that for the Good Hats uh Instagram. Just kind of Ooh, calling out uh. That we love some of that that, that stuff, and, and not only that, um, you know, John Ink Park uh, is the one who, who uh, drew up that front logo. So and the mm-hmm. and the side and the side hit, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it'd be pretty cool. All right, good. This is a good drop. This is a good drop. It I was. thought they were clean, simple looking hats, but but fantastic. Well done. I think trademark uh, Justin work, right? Yep. All right, let's move on to the next slide. This is a really good yeah, slide. See. See the that Jacobs Field patch. You're right. It was a different one. You're right, Jason. Yes, the, this is not the but same. No, as in, in its in its natural colors, that side patch is fine. It's just when they do the limited color palette, it gets just kind of. I'm not gonna yeah. say washed, but just kind of blends together. Man, I, listen, the Colt 45s. I've been saying this for for three or four years now, they're low, the logo and that hat. I just love it. And now they found a side patch that they can use on it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So yeah. it's one of my, my favorite pink bottom of all time uh, is that Cardinals, that Cardinals 67, I think. Right. But my mm-hmm. second favorite was the Colt 45s with no patch, mm-hmm. no patch. Yeah. Navy with a pink bottom. It, I, I just think it's fantastic. Jason, you want to talk a little bit about the Mets hat? So everyone kind of understands what that is. Yeah. So um, in, in 1999, uh, Major League Baseball did a little uh, promotion called Turn Ahead the Clock. So basically, um, the teams had the opportunity to create what their uniforms would look like. I think it was 40 years in the future. I think it was only um, 20. I think was it was it only 20? 20? Yeah, we've, pa- 20? we've passed the we've date. We've passed the Turn Ahead the Clock. Yeah, we have. Yeah. The clock but is any- now. <laughs> but anyway, so really only – I think four teams participated. Uh, the the Mariners. Um, I can't even remember the other two. No, there's a bunch. I think there the first year it was four, and then yeah, the second the year. Royals oh did no, it. the Royals. I, did I know. Too. Yeah. Yes, the Royals did. The Pirates. Did. Yes. Mariners. But yeah. Yeah. Okay. I do. Remember. Okay. But anyway, the Reds. The Jason's like, the okay, Royals. okay, shut up, guys. I'm wrong. Yeah. Yeah. Don't look <laughs> me wrong. Fuck off. Right. <laughs> I don't want to curse this segment here. Um. But the Mets, so most of the teams just like redesigned their uniforms. Um, but the yeah. Mets actually reworked their entire franchise yeah. and they m- moved to the planet Mercury. Yeah. Uh, and, and the series, the turn ahead, the clock series was them coming back from Mercury to play against uh, some, some of the teams here. So this is their, a- their design for the Mercury Mets. Um, I want to be honest with you. That's a, not you. you. You're not the one who created the story. But that's the dumbest yeah. fucking story I've ever heard in my life. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I don't it's know. It's so the bad. It's good. I think it's it's so stupid and so bad that. There's one thing worse than that story. What? The hat. Yeah. Are you kidding I me? still got the hat for the collector value, but same, right, the same. hat is ugly. Shit. This logo and hat has been basically been locked in the vault since. 1999 right uh, so i think the seven it. line did it the, the seven, seven line, line did, did, it. It, did it last year but then they slapped their logo on the back of the I know. so it wasn't it wasn't the original um but this one yeah. finally had the batterman um yeah that was listen these other hats are great on here though yeah this is classic variety pack from them the Colorado um, Rockies in the middle top to me is a sleeper. I like that. I like I like that one for some reason. Yeah, that side patch is real cool. Yeah, oh, the middle one. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. The top right, I got confused. I thought it was a gray bottom. Um, no, that was a that was a shock lavender. drop that just kind of went along with the, these five here. No, the, the middle the middle Rockies was. 
right? I thought they announced the Middle Rockies and shock dropped the Lilac one. No, no, the Middle Rockies was uh, the top Middle Rockies was the shock drop, I think. Wasn't it? Okay. I don't no, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I put that one in with the picture with the others. Hmm. All right. Either but, way, this slide was very expensive. Either, for me. And either better, way, yeah, the well, that sucks. <laughs> Uh, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. It's a nice historical piece. It's fantastic. How you guys like the uh, reverse Oakland? It's good. Uh, and I, don't, I don't like that patch, but I like yeah, the, pa- the, the side patch. Is is terrible. The side patch made me not buy it. I wanted it, but I don't. Even, what is it? Is it thirtieth anniversary? Yeah, I know, but what? Like, what is? Is there an A? And it's an A. Behind? It's an A What's with a the, banner or some shit. Is that a diamond? Like, I don't know. I don't, they 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 it looks they've like an A with like a banner in like the state of California or some shit. Like it looks it almost stupid. looks like a sad pine tree, like one that wouldn't have gotten picked on the, the Christmas tree lot. Yeah, I don't know. It's bad, man. They they've historically I mean we can pretty much say that they've they got the worst side patch portfolio, right? Mm. Uh yeah, I've said it for years. Yeah, like it's not even close, really, right? Mm-mm. They suck. <laughs> the worst patches on the face of the earth. I mean, it's terrible. I mean, if if we I had in, like an expansion team start next year, they would already have a better <laughs> like portfolio than uh, Oakland because you're starting from negative pretty, pretty much. Joe, yeah, Oakland. I'd say that that's fair. Let's move on to the next I mean, one. Oakland will probably, probably be just... starting in a new city anyway next year. So, no, well, there you go. Start a, start a new. Mm-hmm. So a lot of complaining What'd about you guys this. Think, what do you guys think about these? So first, while we're doing this, right, from all, mm-hmm. for all the viewers out there, I'd love to hear what your top three are here. This is like a mm-hmm. polarizing collection, right? This is a polarizing. Some people really loved them. Some people loved some of them. Some people hated them. I want to hear um, from the crowd out there uh, how, you know, what are your top three here? And then I'm going to ask you, uh, Jason Mead, to tell me your top three. Mm-hmm. Uh, for me, um, the Cubs uh, is is a is a keeper. That's a really good hook. Uh, these are all fantastic hooks. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm going to go. Uh, man, so I only get three. Yeah, um, <laughs> I'm going to go with the the Yankees. You keeping that, that one? I'm keeping that one. Just the hook was so good to that, that Joker movie. Um, and then I'll, I'll go with my uh, namesake, Jason Metz. Okay. Leon, how about you? Um, I really like the Mike Myers uh, Cubs. Um, the Freddie Cleveland. Even though I don't like that kind of block C normally, the hook is uh, is really good. I re- so it's it's off color, right? So the bottom is darker than the top. So it's not a mono yeah. crown, right? Okay. Yeah. So I, I really like the Freddy. And then, uh, yeah, I'm with Jason. I like the Joker hook. Originally didn't think of him as a horror character per se. Um, but when you when you put it beside um, uh, Mr. Phoenix in the in, in the movie, it's it's just an excellent, excellent uh, hat. Yeah. yeah everybody, everybody's saying the Yankees is the worst. I mean... Nah. Hey, take the hook away. Um, yeah, it's not definitely not the best hat on the slide, but it's still not the worst hat on the slide. Which movie was the Angels? It wasn't. Oh. It was. Uh, it's not part of the horror pack. Oh, okay. According to T eight hundred John, it was actually cool. a shoe shoe hook. Yeah, I was gonna say that doesn't that doesn't uh, scream horror to me, but yeah, all right. Man, that Colorado is really good too, though. And and Angel, a hook is, um, you know, how, what what inspired the colors of the hat? Yeah, I'm gonna go a different route. I'm just gonna tell you guys which hats I like the best. I'm not. I, I hate horror movies. I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I, I don't. don't I don't watch shit. them at all. I don't like that shit. But I, my favorites on this slide are the Rangers. I love. I don't know. I like that hat, man. I do. I like the Cleveland. Um, and then next up, I'd go Colorado. Those are my three favorite hats. Um, these are great. I think they're great, though. I, I do like them. It's just those are my three favorites. Um, 
I don't know. My least favorite is probably the Angels. Honestly, I don't like that logo, but um, mm-hmm. a lot of people are hating on that Cubs hat, but I think that Cubs hat in hand is going to look really, really good. Oh, yeah. I think people no. are hating because it was like impossible to get. Maybe. I don't know. Well, I think I some think, of the I pictures think make it look kind of like light. Yeah, I don't know. I th- I think it's the best looking hat on the screen. Uh, it's the most out the box. Yeah. I feel like it's the most out the box. Like he actually tried to put the character in there, which is pretty cool. Mm. All right. Fair enough. All right. Thanks for all the participation out there, everybody. Make sure you're hitting that like button as we kind of move on here. Uh, we have 145 people in here and we have, let's see how many likes we have. We have 61 likes. I mean, come on. Oh, let's geez. hit that like button, everybody. And um, hit the like button for us because you're not, uh, you're not going to like what you're about to see. <laughs> caps unlimited. I mean, Jesus. Um, the yellow hat. What's up with that yellow hat? I, so, I, 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 I don't know if I picked that as my weeper. I probably did. I, I don't want to spoil the fun, but I think I did pick that piece of shit. That's a terrible hat. Like, look at that thing. Yeah. Is it? What's going on with this Giants hat too? The Giants one. I could get I could get on board. With that side patch? Yeah, the the football side patch might be okay. The, yeah, the, the football yeah. The side patch might be better in hand, maybe, but yeah. Uh, me kind of I mean, looking that's at the, it from that's the, the best, view. that's the best hat on the screen. I mean the, the Giants just on, one? The just I don't mind on, me some just uh, I would take uh, the I would take the Toronto one over that Giants one. Uh no. I'm 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 not counting the just gone ones because we're gonna see those everywhere here in yeah. about a week or two. Those are terrible uh, too though. Like what do I like yeah, those are terrible too. I wouldn't mind the Chicago one because you're from Chicago, but I'm weird like that. I'm not pining for the just Dawn in my team though. I say that and I'll probably end up buying a Raptor one. Yeah, you will. We're losing viewers the longer we stay on the slide. We're from 46 <laughs> to 132 in seconds. Like it's just like let's get this thing off of here. Yeah. Let's move on to Capanova. Yeah. You feel like strawberries almost or something? What, what what's the theme here? Uh, I don't remember. Is there a theme? There was a theme. And I can't mm. remember. I think the theme was bright as fuck. Yeah, it's like the, the camera can't handle it almost. Oh, uh, this is Glow. Glow okay. Pack. Glow Pack. Okay. For for those who don't know, that, that color in the catalog is pink glow. So they, yeah. that, I'm assuming that's kind of where it derived from, maybe. Mm-hmm. Maybe it glows in dark too. Uh, no, Listen, I think I'm not to gonna make... say I don't hate these, man. I just, I don't know. But I'm not gonna run out and buy them. Yeah, but... I feel like the White Sox they use the wrong green on the front. Yeah, yep. Um, but they might be okay in hand. I'm not huge on the dinner plate Mets. Um, that's too big. That's way yeah, they've used it. They big. they've used that one quite a bit. Yeah. The yeah. Phillies has a very uninspiring side patch. No, it is. that has I, probably I, the best I, of the bunch if you change the side patch. Yeah, I do. I like mean, that, the Phillies that, has kind of like a fresh Prince feel, right? A little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. What were you saying, Jason? I do like that Phillies logo, script logo. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah. But yeah, then they just picked the absolute wrong side patch. What were you going to say, Leon? The, the Phillies side patch looks like when. Uh, you go into the lids and they, they include the embroidery to, to, to trick you into buying it by pre-embroidering it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'd love to hear from everyone out there if you were forced to buy one of these. And don't be wise asses. I know what you're going to write. Which one are you going to buy? If you're forced to buy one of these, which one are you going to buy? And I'll start with you, Leon, as our viewers start to answer that question in the comments. Yeah. I'm split between the, the Cubs and the Reds. So gun to my head, I'll take the Cubs. <laughs> And since Leon bought the Cubs, I'll buy the Reds. Yeah, I would um, go with Reds too. I would go with Reds too. Yeah. I, like the Cubs summary is, okay. I just I'm not a fan of that side patch there either. What's the under on this? Uh lime. Lime. I was gonna say a gray under would be good to stick because the top is just there's so much going on in the top. You kind of I don't know, man. I don't know. Gray on this. 
Really? Uh, I think lime makes more sense than gray. Yeah, I wouldn't want. Yeah. Gray would just it. add a whole like this. Yeah. No, nah, I mean, I don't think so. If you're gonna go bright like this, you might as well just go all the way. Just go the whole way. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you like those high voltage, the the pink and yeah. the bolt. So these aren't that far off from. Like if you turn the your color contrast down a little bit, you'd have these. All right, let's go to the sneaker room, guys. They're finally back. They're back. And this ain't a bad hat. This man. is a good hat. Yeah. It's not bad. Nah, this ain't a bad hat at all. Yeah, I don't mind this hat at all, actually. I feel nah. like Coppers came up with something really similar, except with a red bottom. But I wouldn't mind this hat. I like I, I like this hat. Like this is a yeah. nice clean hat, nice earthy colors. I like this hat. Man. White guts, green bottom, never can go wrong. Nope. And green bottoms would really go with that with that chocolate brown, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I do I do like this hat a lot, man. And red always looks fantastic on brown too. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know where no, sneaker they just, they just took guess, off. I'm guessing before. they were a, a victim of uh Allocation supply, supply chain issues. Mm-hmm. Even some allocation crunch. Yeah. Listen, they they do. You know, I know, I know, Leon. From time to time, you you've hated on some of their hats. I think we all have hit on a couple, but they're they don't make egregiously bad hats. They make they make solid hats, man. Oh, they make good. They, yeah. they make solid hats. Even that bread and butter stuff was good. I, I don't know, man. They, they 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 do a good job. They do a good job over there. This is another solid hat from them. Good to see them back, and uh, we'll move on to uh, Hat Heaven. We're gonna we're gonna ask our our viewers out there, keep two, drop two, to all of our viewers out there, um, while we do that here. So, Jason Mead, I'll start with you this time. Keep two, drop two. Uh, yeah, I'll keep the the top two right ones. Um, the mm-hmm. Braves and the the uh, Los Angeles Angels. Those are the only two I bought, Jason. Yeah. Um. And then drop two, uh, I gotta go with the um, the two right below it, the the Disney wings. <laughs> Those are wow. good plain jeans. All right, the, I mean, they're, All right. they're they're fine. It's just yeah. I, I I gotta drop two. Yeah. All right, Leon, which two are you keeping? Which two are you dropping? All right, I really like the uh, Atlanta, um, the sky blue navy with the gray under. I'm regretting not buying that, so I might have to circle back. And get it. Um, bottom, middle, and bottom left. That's the New York Cubans, correct? Yep. Negro League team. Mm-hmm. I will always um, want to pick up uh, Negro League teams' uh, hats. So I will go with um, the left one. Is that burgundy? I To this day, I don't know the difference between burgundy and maroon. So I'm assuming, to me, that looks maroon. But I always go with the opposite and say, because that's what uh, I think I'm wrong. But. To me, that's maroon, but that's a burgundy, right? I might actually be. Is that cardinal? But either way, bottom left hand corner is my keeper. I'm going to drop the Arizona uh, Mm -hmm. flag hat. um, And I'll drop the Mariners bottom right. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just. It's just uh, something had to be. Well, you already already got sky blue in the in the Braves. I mean, yeah. I'm keeping the Braves and the uh, and the uh, Los Angeles Angels in the upper right. I'm getting rid of, uh, I'd say, the mono Angels hat okay. and that Diamondbacks hat. And and just for the viewers out there, I, I don't buy uh, a ton of Negro League hats from New Era anymore. I save that for uh, Ebbets. I don't know. It, it, there's something about me with Ebbets that I just love their Negro League hats, so I kind of stick with them. They don't come out quite as often, but I still I still love those, so. Um, and thank you to all the viewers out there participating. We appreciate it. Um, it looks like uh, it looks like that Atlanta Braves hat is the big winner on this slide um, in terms hat. of the viewers. It's beautiful, man. It's gorgeous. I, I love that lowercase a as well. Um, well let's move on to, uh, I'd say, the hottest hat store right now. Um, you know, I, th- I think right now at this very moment, Toppers is probably the hottest hat store out there. And let's start here with this slide. Um, I, gosh, I, I kind of like that black and white Nets hat. I was just going to say that. That's pretty cool. I don't remember that coming out. It was this morning. Well, because. Oh, yeah. well, I've totally missed the morning then. Yes, you did. 
today was a rough like, day. Well, it's rough when you start your day at 5 p.m. Yeah, right. That's a different that's a different subject for another day. But that Nets hat is excellent. I like the simplicity of it. I do too. I like the Nets hat next to it too. It's got Kerry Kittle vibes. Yeah. There's Derek Drazen Coleman. Petr- well. Drazen Petrovic. Yeah. Derek Coleman. Derek Coleman, yep. Yeah. Derek Coleman. Yeah, I like these, man. I mean, I, I I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm not a big fan of the Raiders hat or the Tampa Bay Bucks hat on here. Mm-hmm. But yeah. you know, the rest of them. The rest of my, I, I, I like. I was just gonna ask really? you guys that. Like, do you guys feel differently with the the NFL? Co- I don't know something about NFL teams when they're like totally fashion. I don't know something about them. And I'm not really. No, it's just. Into. I just I don't like the white logo on the brown and pink. So okay. That's why I don't like that Buccaneers one and the Raiders one. It's just something about that dark under visor. Um. I get why he did it. I'm just not a fan of it. Hmm. I, I just feel like it's such a tribal sport too. You know, like you, like you go there, you you tailgate or you dress up, and you know you you show up in the colors. I just something about the team not being in the regular colors is kind of no. Nah, it's 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 much easier to buy not your team in a fashion color. Um, like, okay. You know, like that New York Giants one from a couple of slides ago. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. I would never buy a rival in any killer. Yeah, Rice, you're right. Don't forget Kenny Anderson, uh, Georgia Tech. Georgia Tech's Kenny Anderson, one of my favorite point guards growing up. Um, Let's like move him. on to the next. Uh, what's that, Jay? What's that, Leon? I don't like him because he refused to uh, come to the Raptors. He's a smart man. <laughs> we traded him for Damon Stoudemire, and then he, he didn't want to come. He didn't so we, had those, to, we had to trade him for Chauncey Billups. He didn't want to pay those taxes. There's some good shit on this slide for sure. I mean, yes, sir. I like that mm-hmm. Diamondbacks in the upper right for some reason. Oh, that's really good. Yeah. I think he has a black a, version of that coming out, right? He's got a black version of that coming. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's an excellent hat. I like the Reds in the middle. I like that Cubs. Mm-hmm. I, like I like that Tigers. Reds. I like the green Reds. That's that's very much uh, that's very corporate. much like the uh, corporate one. Oh, yeah. what happened to this slide? This slide was bad. What? Whoa! Yeah, doubled up. Yeah. I didn't see that. I didn't notice uh, that was, at first. <laughs> we're we're doing a little three D effect. See if anybody notices. Yeah. yeah, put on your three D glasses. No, I didn't even notice it, Jason, until I looked over. Yeah, it. I, I wasn't know. paying attention. But uh, these are good hats, man. Very solid. Very the short solid. one's really cool too. If you don't have anything kind of similar to that. Dude, it's simple and just and yeah. just clean, right? Which What's which your favorite the hat on here, Jason? Uh, my favorite hat on here will be the uh, I go with the Cubs. Mm. Okay, mine's probably that Diamondbacks, and then if I had to go a second, I'd say the Reds in the dead in dead center. Which of the Angels do you prefer? Because they're kind of similar but yet different. I know Jason oh. hates that side patch on the left. Especially when it's washed like that, it's even worse. Yeah. Which one do you prefer? Suffering, man. I'm not a huge fan of either of those when I'm yeah. looking at this total slide. If I had to pick one, I'm going with the one on the left. I do like the front logo on the one left a lot better. The way it's colored. Oh, really? I like the one. I, I like the front logo on the one on the left. And then is that what you said? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I like the side patch better on the on the one on the right. Yep. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's move on, guys. Next slide of uh, toppers. Mm-hmm. This oh, is that twins, slide. man. This is a is good that Minnesota twins. like a Minnesota Gophers hook? Uh, if it is, I don't think it was intentional. But really, yeah, looks well, it, the, the Gophers are more of a yellow. This is a yeah. tan. Mm. Um, Still a good looking hat. My favorite yeah. on here is the Twins, though, by far. I, and that that Dodgers hat is good too, man. Mm-hmm. Just uh, the the Twins covered. reminds me of like the Arctic Peach Diamondback. Yeah, it's right? the same. Yeah, same kind of style. You know, you know what I was just thinking, guys. What? I wonder how Rachel's doing. <laughs> <laughs> I was not thinking that. In fact, you think, I forgot about Rachel the minute I uh, blocked you think, her from the channel. You think Rachel would like 
the Blue Jays or the Brewers more? Ra- Rachel would like the Inland Empire one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Real Why, Rachel? Rachel? <laughs> Why? Why? Because you want to hit her over the head with that wrench? That might have something to do with it. Or I, I just that's my least favorite on the slide. Yeah, they used the bigger. My least favorite, uh, on, the, uh, my least favorite on the slide is the uh, stomper. Yeah, it might be the Oakland one too. That reminds me of C plus. Do you guys have C plus down there? Um, no, I'm like some Canadian sort of, is orange, that, yeah, like, yeah, orange pop, basically. <laughs> oh, so so it's equivalent to you guys have crush, I believe, right? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Mad so, McAdam so, said Rachel went back to her ship that just fitted. <laughs> Uh, that's how you know. That's how you know someone watches the show religiously, right? When they're <laughs> when they've oh, yeah, got yeah. like something like that. Yeah, we they're haven't. Like, yeah, we right haven't. Before. We haven't covered just fitted in like three months, four months, I think. No, no, it's been longer than that. Ban, I think I. I ban, think uh, from the show. I think I said. I said to Jason. Well, Jason, how long do you think it was? It was six months, maybe. I. No, no, it's only been a, like a couple of months. Do you remember the message I sent you? I don't want to ever see them on this fucking show again. <laughs> I think it was. De- it wasn't a message. It was a declaration during the show. I think it was. Yeah, yeah. You just declared. Oh, it, it was during the show. Oh, I thought yeah, it was yeah, a message. Yeah. No, no. You're like, all right. I'm just gonna say it now. We're gonna make an. Ex- you're gonna make an executive decision. They will never be on the show again. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. and they're not. So let's How move on f- to my finish, guys. How you feel about the 1980 All Star Patch? That's the bigger one. I right? like that. I like that version. Like of it, it's got man. more detail on it, right? Yeah, and I like the way it's. Is that the the original color of it? I think it's in the it's in the original the colors, but that's smaller though. That one I believe is the jersey patch. The one that we're used to is the hat patch. And it's smaller. The the hat patch is smaller. Yeah. Yeah, it, it doesn't have all the logos in it and stuff. No, no, it does. No, it has all the stars. What it doesn't have is all of the um the inner stuff, the color, right? It doesn't have the big LA, I don't think. Yeah, yeah. And the All Star Game Texas looks different to me, but yeah, it's way smaller though. That's a cool patch. I like that patch. Yeah, Gabe nine three zero three says it was during the show, so he must. Yeah, be a I remember. Long I remember time. you saying saying it during the show. Especially, it was a slide of all the Boston My Fitteds that they stole. You basically said, I don't want to see these fuckers on the show ever again. It's one of the more egregious uh, mm-hmm. pirate ship robberies. Mm-hmm. There's a yeah, lot of like, pre stuff. That was like grand theft, right? In yeah, fact, we're, we're, we're going to see Go a ahead. couple of those Boston ones right now. Yeah, we are actually. That yeah, was, was the top five, right, right one, right? Yeah. It was the top right yeah. one, I think, that made it. So that's how long there's it some took. good hat. There's some good hats here, man. So you got the oyster crackers in the middle. Dude, you got the wings of the fire I have man on the left. The wings of fire red stocks. You got that strawberry cheesecake. You got the wings of fire cardinals. The wings of fire grangers. I like. I like. The, I like the Padres because I was on the fence, and then you were like, uh, you know, as your friend, I would not steer you wrong. Just buy the fucking Padres. I was like, okay. Dude, uh, it was so it's so nice, man. Yeah, that Padres uh, Padres was lifted by another European store. It was Ooh. fam fam about mm-hmm. six months ago, right? What's your favorite hats on here, guys? So like, oyster I, for me. Oyster's great. Oyster's, oyster's most great. wearable for me. I don't know how I missed on oyster. It's smooth, I'm, man. I must not have been paying attention. Yeah, I'm gonna be frank with you guys. I didn't like the Red Sox Wings of Fire at first until I got it. The one on the right. Yeah, top right. Yeah, I wasn't like a lot of people were like, "Oh man, that thing's so good." I don't. I didn't like it at first, and then I got it. I was like, "Oh man, I like this." What and color is that? The crown. It's like olive with like orange and and like lemon zest. It's like okay, like a dark like a dark olive. I don't know, man. It looks really good. I really like the Cardinals, Oyster Cracker, Braves. I like this entire set. I don't. Me too. The Rangers had that side patch is pretty yeah. cool too. Even though it's on the front yep. too, it's still like cool looking. It's got a lot of metallic in it, right? You can tell. Yeah. 
I like, and and that Wings of Fire Braves is good, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I really like the solo uh, tomahawk. Like it's good. I like it for some reason. I don't know why. I don't yeah, think it's, it's really it's realistic. I don't know if they're walking around coast, tomahawks that big. Coast but. to coast hip hop. My fit is is fairly random on their drop times. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Don Carrera, don't search your lemons. That's bullshit tonight. Let's move on no. to Sports World 165. Yeah, or you can go hang out with Rachel. <laughs> no, he is Rachel. We already established oh, that's that. Right, right, Don that's right. Don is Rachel. Is this the only Sports World drop? This was the only drop they had, and it was in-app only. Um, they had they, they restocked like a couple of Indians, um, Wahoos, but this oh. was the only new hat they had this week. That's an optic way. It's optic white, yeah. I don't know if I'm going to be that. I'm. I'm going to try to make it a point not to be scared of optic white this this year. It's, it's a nice looking. Be hat. scared. Be scared. Be scared. Yeah. Try lightly. <laughs> optic white, I do very rarely, man. All right, fair enough. I don't know, but it's up to you, man. But a, a man of your ilk, Leon. <laughs> but he's in Canada. I'm cold. Half he's also now. like, he's yeah. a big dude, man. He sweats a little bit. I've seen this guy work a little bit. We, we were unloading a truck in that uh, is, Anaheim. That is definitely not my natural habitat. No, uh, that's a, like 100 that's... degrees in November. That's not my natural. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't. No, it was too. That was weird, right? It's like yeah. 110, uh, 100 degrees in, in November. November. That's not this normal. Son of a bitch, he was sweating. This dude, this dude was sweating. Yeah. And optic white would not have survived that day. No, I and did wear off white that day. You did. Yeah, that was a bad choice. Yeah, just a screaming for a blue blue button too. <laughs> ah, shut up, Leon. I knew that was coming. <laughs> it comes Leon's with a like pin, a though. Squat- That's pretty cool. Leon's like the squatchy police. Let's move That's- on to stash twelve fifty. That's cool, Coleman Ty Go ahead, sorry, yeah. Jason. I was just saying that was a cool pen. Yeah, so first on the right, you have the fuck you, Vuce the Vault, uh, Daryl Strawberry. Yeah. I'm yeah. A, uh, well, I see your Daryl Strawberry. strawberry. I'm going to hold my beer. That's what Ty said to us <laughs> on that one. Hold my beer. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah, another example of uh, great minds think alike, though. I think. Uh, we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll follow into that. Ours had a different feel to it, though, man. We weren't going okay. for, like... This dude, we, we had a side patch oh. that looked like a strawberry. This motherfucker's like, no, I'm gonna make a hat that looks like a strawberry. <laughs> like, yeah. all right, man. Yeah, gotcha. But uh, th- that great looking hat, man. Um, I don't know. These are both good, man. I like yeah. these. Ty's like, so you guys think you can design hats, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's like, he's like, he's like, fuck you, Pierre. Nice, nice try, nice try, kids. Yeah, nice. Look, yeah. Let the men. Yeah, I like how you said that. Hold my, <laughs> hold my beer. Hold my beer. That's good. I don't think Ty drinks, so he doesn't strike me as no, a no, drinker. No, no. That's just a that's a meme. I know. I, I know. I know what it is. It's a, and yeah. you used it perfectly. Yeah. But uh, great hats. Ty Mathis doesn't mess around. He's been doing great stuff. Uh, yeah. like his resurgence has been impressive to watch. So, mm-hmm. stash twelve fifty. Ty Mathis, nice job. And I, I this next line's gonna suck. I can already tell by the name of the fucking company. Oh, uh, uh, huh. Fasten your seatbelts, Pierre. I couldn't have left that right. Well, I, I mean, left it, not bad. It's not. It's not like a roller coaster right here. But the, the Mariners is pretty good. Yeah, the Mariners possible. That, shit, that hat sucks. <laughs> the one on the the one. On, <laughs> it's like the one. It's literally got. It's li- that hat. Literally, that hat sucks. You know, the one on the left. Could, you know, yes. Next time, next, it's not next, bad. Next time they have hats, I'm gonna put a different name on it but it's not going to matter because you're going to tell immediately from the angle of these photos like i know um no that mariners one's good no it's not it is let's know in the comments you copying that mariners that mariners ain't bad missing the woven patch that's a lids clearance hat circa 2017 just a woven no. patch no he says missing I'm it saying, he's missing it oh, missing. oh okay I, I, this is that hat is like just like blah it's like a slate blue, almost like a flint blue. Oh, yeah. It's got a blue under. It's not bad. Who the hell asked for a hat with candlestick park on the front and then a, a busted up tell it goodbye side patch, honestly. The, the only thing that's bad about the, well, not the only thing. The big thing that's bad with the one on the right 
is that people who like those hats see those hats and ask for more types of hats like this. Yeah. I saw someone like, try to start like a like a, a thread like, hey man, we need more like stadium patches like this. It's like this is the who who wants these like postcard looking? Nah, that hat on the right is for people that go to Seven Eleven to buy their lunch. You know, you know or, what I mean. Or they, they, work at, they work at Candlestick Park. God. I mean, I don't know. I, yeah. No, I like the one yeah. on the left. I'm with Leon. Yeah, they both suck. Let's move on to capsule hats. <laughs> All right. Okay. The Angels one's good. I think that Yankees in the lower right, if I get a better goddamn look at it, it's pretty good. I I can't pink bottom, yeah. I think. That's what they give us. No, but he just he just their their he Instagram would... photos are so good and then no, but he What's told that? me too that he t- he just we were t- we were messaging back and forth. He's like, "Hey man, I took your advice from the show and I changed the angle of the pictures of the hats." And now I'm What's looking so- at another side profile, another mug shot. <laughs> yeah, you can that tell. The Yankee on the lower right looks nice, man. I can tell that that's a good looking hat. It's got metallic in it. Yeah, I'm confused about the Detroit patch though on the lo- bottom left. The color is nice. Like the blue yeah. is really nice. I'm not even uh-huh. mad at the red icy. Uh, well, that's left. like, is that red or is that like the infrared? Is I can't really I tell. feel like that's scarlet. That is. And it could be a red. blue under or a gray under. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a no, it's a blue under. It's icy blue. Icy yeah. blue under. Okay. Yeah, all pretty solid. I'm just yeah, confused about the, the, the. I, the I like the Yankee. Though. I like the Yankees lower right the best. Mm-hmm. I do like the color on that angel. Do you, do you like this angels or the toppers uh, kind of similar uh, front and side? Which this, one would you pick? Uh, this one, just because you can actually read what the side patch says. Okay. Mm-hmm. Toppers one was, was too washed for that. All right. Before we move on to Capsule Toronto, I just want to pause here. We have about 140 people uh, watching with us. Thank you for joining us tonight. We have 90 likes. Let's get that like number over that 100 mark, please. And for those that don't know, uh, we've created a vibrant hack community over on Discord. Why Discord, you may ask? Because Discord allows for much more functionality. It allows for very clear lanes to have discussions in. Um, and what we've created over there now is pretty fantastic. You've got the you've got the hat crawler over there creating some of the fastest hat no- notifications on the planet. You've mm-hmm. got um, you've got listen, you've got so much going on over there. You've got great discussions happening. We're going to have some exclusive drops with vendors that happen only on Discord. There's so much stuff coming, and I got to tell you, when you get in there, and you're going to get in there eventually because you're not going to want to miss what's happening over there. Sh- turn off those notifications, and then go in. And really tailor it to what you want to be notified on, and then check in daily, check in on multiple times throughout the day because the conversations are fantastic over there. And Don Carrera, stop saying what is Discord because you've already joined and you've already been in there. You're just not going back in there regularly. Um, and for that, we all thank you, Don Carrera. Um, and let's and I love you, Don. You know that. Let's move on to Capsule Toronto, fellas. All right. A little plain Jane action. Mm-hmm. White sweatband, gray under, can't go wrong. This is uh fucking boring. I mean, <laughs> why it's staple hats if you don't have them in your collection? Uh hard to find a good gray bottom in Canada sometimes, not always, sometimes. Oh. All right, uh, come on, man. The Jay Z classic uh look. I like the uh, Walrus yeah, one a lot. I like the Walrus one a lot. So, so uh, Team Collective is doing. I think they're calling it the. Was it the 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 wildfire or the? Hold on. Let me get this. Wildfire, right. like what no. the hell does that have to do with this? No, with the with the hockey league, they got a specific name for the hockey stuff. Uh, Wildlife Hockey League. So they're uh, um, challenging new artists to get involved. 
um, with this. These are Jason Volante hats. So the walrus one and the moose, uh, Jason V clinker of clinker yeah. fame uh, has entered into the wildlife hockey who league. Robot, who made that robot looking thing down in the lower right? Um, that one. I'm not sure who exactly did the art. Maybe Jacobo. I could be wrong. Really? That's Jacobo. No, I know. I don't buy that. <laughs> Jacobo. Jacobo. That's Jacobo's worst, worst piece so far. That's the Megatron. Um, you can't recognize that as Jacobo's work. I, I, I see that before I even knew it was Jacobo. I can kind of see that. Is, yeah, that, that's a Calvin Johnson uh, tribute. Uh, Detroit Lions this fans have No, you know what? I'm going to be frank with you. I want to give Casey a shout out here. This is what happens when Casey's not involved. For the Megatron? Yeah, like, listen, man. Like, Casey from Clank Room would never allow that. That that's worse than anything we see. I love Jacobo, you know that man. Mm-hmm. But Casey would have guide, guided this to a place where that doesn't happen. That's fair. That's not an impressive logo. Jacobo's really into the the, the walrus one. Look at this. Huh? I'm really into the walrus one. I think that yeah, I like cool. the walrus. I like the Jason Volante ones. But yeah. you know, Jacobo's fantastic. He he won a fitty last year. Mm-hmm. Um, for his logo creation, this is this one is bad, man. That's when you don't have any gatekeeping happening. You don't have the right person saying, "All right, we shouldn't do this. We should like alter this or change this a little bit." <sighs> Who did the upper left? Let me find out. Let me find out. Uh, Matthew Bell, I believe. Yeah, mm. Matt Bell. That's uh, not bad. He found he found he found a place. I mean, he's always making hockey designs, so this is a mm-hmm. great place to uh, kind of get in there and get involved. But uh, yeah, it's kind of like uh, taking over for uh, the Hat Club Hockey League, kind of shutting down. So I don't know. I'm not too mad at him because, quite honestly, you can't get that many hockey themed hats right now. So. Mm. All right, let's move on, guys. It is the smaller 1980 patch. It does have the LA on it. It's just yeah. not like 3D text. Yeah. And then the, yeah. the All-Star game. Right, what, I, what I was saying is the difference was that they did this like kind of outline on the other one. That was the big – the size then allowed for an outline. Yeah. Mm. It's not a bad hat. This is a good hat, man. I mean – Maroon. Oh. And kind of like a greenish color, yeah. See, in my head, I always, if I see this color, I think burgundy, but it's actually maroon. All right, man. This is your new thing, though. All right, all right. We're going to teach you after the show. All right. Let's move on to the capologist. And Leon, why don't you take us through this? Yeah, shout out to Tony, who uh, hit live on the, uh, <laughs> on the website, because I was definitely sleeping when we dropped this uh, 3 p.m., <laughs> Uh, Eastern, um, we're back with another Moon Reaper. Uh, Reapers and Cream, Big Dave uh, dubbed it. Uh, Off-White with Houston Brick Red. Um, yeah, I believe this is our like sixth Moon Reaper. Um, sold pretty well. I think there's only like three three sizes left, so shout out to everyone who's caught so far. Nice, nice hat. Nice job, uh, nice job, Tony. Let's move on to the clink room. And uh, if uh, Jason, if you don't mind kind of navigating this one for us, that would be great. Oh, Jesus, you put me on the spot. Because um, I'm not sure what any of these are, actually. Uh, well, you've seen the, this thing like a bee come back, right? Right. Unchanged. That was... um. God, yeah. Uh, give me a second here. Uh, so, the sting like a bee is a, uh, another one by J, uh, J Jason, Matz. Right? Oh, J Matz. Okay. No, J Matz. He did uh, like a charging version, and this is more like a swinging version. Uh, let's see who else we got here. We got the, the goldfish, the samurai koi is Phil. Phil Hauser. Phil Hauser and uh, Tanzacan. Luis, I think is his name. Yeah, Mendoza. Yep. Uh, Momo, Mo Money Honey is Jacobo. That was actually kind of cool. Continuing his money see. themed hats. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I like let's that. See. One. Yeah, the King Cobra is by Matthew Bell. Okay. Uh, I remember got, that yeah, that Muhammad Ali one. That's Jay Matz, right? 
Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yep. The original one was uh, like purple and it was like a forest daughter, I think. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see. I'm not sure what the. Uh... No, the um, arcade machine one got taken down. That's what happened. That's why they dropped a new one today. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But that was taken down because Leon uncovered via Tony that it was stolen art. Yeah. Yeah. And then great uh, job to see. Casey. Great job to Casey and the team over there, like identifying mm-hmm. and, and pulling that down. And the flaming martiki is by Ryan. Ryan Ryan S from Orem, Utah. That's a nice looking hat. And that looks like that's got like Copa vibes, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. and it's, and it uh, goes in the dark. So reminds me like those old like farmers market hats that mm-hmm. people used to go crazy for in Hawaii. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I'm glad they took down the uh, arcade one. Oh. Yeah, was, why don't you tell the story behind that a little bit, Leon? What you found? Uh it, it as an artist that um. My business partner, Tony Ross, had followed for a long time and he had sold the, like he has the the image um, being able to license. I think one of the features is not to submit it as original art to the clink room and sell it to the clink room. So it got taken down. Hmm. Wow. Well, Allegedly. Let's move on to the fanatics, fellas. Does that sound good to you? Mm-hmm. So these weren't a Liz release, right? Nope. These were fanatics. These were fanatics. Yep. And there was some controversy around some of this, right? Oh, people just um, you know, said it was sweethearts from uh from Hat Club. Mm. I mean it's not a direct that? Why is that Rocky's hat off right? and stuff like that? What's that? Yeah, they picked some bad uh <laughs> sample pictures. The yeah. Rockies one's jacked, but uh, they're not direct ripoffs. I mean, it's in the same color scheme, right? But they didn't necessarily just reproduce them, right? Yeah, nice. And they uh, they did a lot more teams. There's three slides of these, so let's keep moving. Let's keep looking at them. There's some good ones in here. Yeah, there's some good ones. The Expos, you can never go wrong with the Expos. Nope. That that one is almost directly like a sweetheart one. Just the pinks are lighter. I wasn't even a huge fan of sweethearts, to be honest with you. Yeah. They only did like 12 teams in the, the yeah. maroon. Well, they had two colorways though. Right. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. And then let's see what's the last, last page here. Oh yeah. I mean, some of the better ones are on here. That's weird how they went with that Washington Nationals one. That's an odd front logo to use, right? Yeah, yeah the it's like the stars and stripes one. Yeah. Mm. I think that's like their alternate hat, right? Sometimes they wear that hat. Yeah. All right, let's move on to ECAP City. Cubs isn't bad. There's that Phillies and Pirates all-star game mismatch again. <laughs> I'm just wondering if they don't know that that's their separate teams. Because they do it all the time. The Philly one looks like it would be that uh, that Yeezy hook maybe, right? It probably is, yeah. No, I know. I'm getting, kind of getting tired of this shit every week with this decap city. <laughs> They sell, they sell well, right? They do well, right? I mean, everything sells out right now. Yeah. I mean, I guess the Cardinals hat isn't bad. You know, the Cubs is going to sell out because that was actually a leader's hat. Oh, it was? Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. I don't know, man. Like, what else to say <laughs> about this? <laughs> I'm running out of things to say. Is ECAP doing ECAP things, I guess, you know? Nothing. Uh... <sighs> I respect them for being around a long time, but I don't, they haven't done anything really of... Uh... Yeah, well, cockro- cockroaches have been around since the, since the uh, beginning. 
civil of time and I mean I don't know. He captured it. Thank you, Erdines. Love this hat. Thank God. It's almost like we get a it's fresh palate cleanser. My favorite of that pack, too. Yeah. Yeah, I love this hat. Kind of reminds me of like the front of the Arctic Peach, where it's like all metallic at the front. Kind of Ty Mathis is something similar to in that same yeah. kind of vein. I like it. Yeah, this is a, this is a good ass hat, man. I love this hat. <laughs> Jason has uh, reporting is their uh, ECAP shipping is not as fast as it used to be as well. That was their one uh, <laughs> their one positive feature before. <laughs> one claim to fame. Yeah. That and the uh, remember the handshake thing on the website. Oh, yeah. Oh. Well, that, that's that's an hour. Here. Yeah, that's, that's an hour you'll never get back in life. Issue. Right? You'd really like, wanted something from them, and it took mm-hmm. you an yeah, hour. It was, like, it was like, listen, fucker, I don't want a handshake. I just want to buy my hat. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's move on. Exclusive. Their site crashed. Yeah. All right. I'd love to hear from everyone out there. Uh, we haven't engaged with you in a little bit. Um, keep two, drop two. Leon W. Chen, keep two, drop two. I'll keep the Marlins. Um, it kind of reminds me a little bit um, of like a, almost like a Dolphins hook, almost like a Vice hook. I don't mm-hmm. know. Take the Marlins. I guess I'll keep the Cubs. Mm-hmm. Hype beast reasons. I'm going to drop the swinging tiger because I'm about done with him. Um, and I'll drop. Yeah, the, yeah but that uh, one's not bad, though. I mean, not bad being a re- I've seen a lot, term, a lot yeah. worse ti- tiger abuse. Yeah. Me too, yeah. man. Me too. This one's more like, you know. Hmm. It's like like a tiger, but it's it's in a slightly bigger cage. It's not totally being abused but and i'll drop the yankee uh with the outline jason keep two drop two buddy i can see you're getting uh, tuckered out over there but i gotta keep you on your toes no 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 i'm good um i agree with leon i'm dropping that yankees actually no take that back i will drop both the pirates okay and oh. and then uh my keep give me both the high pats the Cubs and the Swinging Tiger. Oh, you're trying to resell now, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Paying for the server that, that's, Yeah, that's it. You know how the curse you know how I mean, curse I mean, if I'm going to be accused of being a bad bot, I might as well be a bad bot. Mm-hmm. Let's, just, let's just start reselling. Maybe we're going to change, we're gonna change, we're gonna change the format of this show. It's just going to be, <laughs> just gonna be awesome going on, all night long. Maybe I maybe maybe I'm trying maybe I'm trying to make Jason feel better, but I'm going with Jason on this. I'm keeping the Cubs and the swinging tiger. I'm dropping uh, that tiger walking through the D, mm-hmm. and I'm I'm getting rid of that Cardinals in the upper right. Man, there's some bad hats on this slide, man. I mean, what color is this? Do you think? Is it like a stone almost? Is it all off? Call the cream of the crop. Cream of the crop. The cream of the crop got to get out of the shadows, though, man. It's just like... yeah. I think that's part of their issue is they're taking it in shadows. It's like you outside for his natural light, but I'm going to take it underneath a rock. On the website, it definitely looks green. Okay. No. All right. Let's go to the NBA store. I'm sure they have some tricks up their sleeve. Oh, they have some nuggets, man. Denver. Mm. <clears throat> Good stuff. Well, these are some pretty shitty hats. Yeah. Wow. When you think back uh, to um, the All Star Game in Chicago, when we had some of the best All Star Game hats ever. Yep. Mm-hmm. They go to the, go to the, the home. Welcome to Cleveland. These. You know, you have that Christ. phrase. Um, lower right, you're not- lower right. What the hell is that? <laughs> Yeah, you know you 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 have the phrase uh, seam ornament. Yeah, that bottom left, that's a seam topper, man. <laughs> like, yeah, it looks like something you put on top of your fucking Christmas tree. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying. Like it's oh man, what the hell? Um, I do like that camo pattern. 
Okay. Really? Yeah, I want to see some other stores get their that's hands like on the, that. That's like the see? unused duck camo pattern. Yeah. Like the one that got messed up. I, I mean, in the right hands, I think that that pattern could be could be pretty good. <laughs> Listen, uh, Sneaker Dad said, I asked myself if he wanted the top right, and he said, why? <laughs> <laughs> why are you punishing me, Dad? Yeah. Um, and, and actually, I, I don't mind the bottom left. But they just went even more crazy with the embroidery on the back. I, just went, like, I don't even want to know what's like, back there. Yeah, they just filled it in. Like they got just nothing be- else to be famous for than these, like all these bridges and stuff. Like they're really like sticking to this bridge claim the fame thing. Well, the architecture. That's about all that's left. No, the rock the, the rock and roll hall of fame is out there though. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But I mean, like the Guardians was named after their bridges. And stuff, and then now this logo Listen, gotta have breeze, all the bridges. If the breeze is blowing just right, you get the worst smell of your life. Cleveland smells ugh. really. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, I think it's, it comes off the lake or something. Mm. Mm. Some nasty smell. I'm like, when I got off the plane, I thought it smells it smells like I got I, I dubbed the saying when I was out there, it smelled like Cleveland. Nasty. And then we then I was walking with some of my buddies. We went over the train tracks, right? And all of a sudden we were in a different fucking world, man. I'm like, all right, let's get out of here. Yeah. Scared for my life. I saw someone uh, and it smelled uh, bad at the same time, so it was like a double whammy. Let's yeah, move Matt, on. Mc- to- yes, right. Matt McAdams, those are two-tone UVs. You got it. Split UVs. Uh, Jason likes those, by the way. It's no, not future, paper man. mills, man. The older that that comes off the dirty ass lake that's over there. It's like, yeah, an old fish smell. Yeah. No, I like Cool J's, man. I don't know if I, I – this isn't my favorite Marlins hat, but they do a great job. Mm-hmm. Cool J's is – Frozen tuna. I love, Mar- I love Marlins hats, though. You guys yeah. do? Yeah. Love yeah. I don't actually have very many of them. No, I think about it. I probably like I'll- 40 of I was more oh, I into the Florida, the Florida Marlins, and the Miami Marlins, but now I'm learning to like the Miami logo a little bit more. I told you, you did a. I mean, the the viewers won't know for a couple months, but uh, yeah, we, that little Miami thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. That's, That's your only one. Word. That's your only. No, word. no, no. I was just, I, I just happened to notice it's like the same color. Oh. Different you that? That's more you have, you have more of a, a calm green there. This is a little bit more yeah, like a bright, lime right? green. Yeah. No, this is no, that's the lighting in my room. This is about the same lime? green. Yeah. You look like you every, time you guys show, every time you guys show a hat in front of these goddamn cameras, it makes me it it reminds yeah. me that I need to buy you new cameras. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> cameras in the works. Right. Yeah, they're <sighs> coming. They're- all right, let's move on to Better Generation, uh, the home of the hat app. And then knowing, you know, I missed on this. I wanted the Atlanta Braves hat on this. Mm-hmm. Corduroy. Oh, these are good, man. These are fucking smooth, man. The Better Generation. So they released these on an app good. only? These were in app only, yeah. Interesting. These are fucking great, man. Uh, the colors are nice. The LA side patch is really well executed. Dude, this whole this whole pack is well executed. Where are these guys out of? I think Houston. 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 That's how I you say so. Houston Street in New York. Houston. That's how you say it in New York. Yeah, Houston Street. Yeah. The olive's a good touch. Nah, these are good hats. That 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 dark if navy or black. It's black. Black, black. Yeah, with black all of under. I mean, these are beautiful hats, man. Better Listen, this has got me paying attention to them, man. I, I mean, I like this a lot. That's a good one. This might make me uh, download their app. Oh, I hate doing that, though. I've got so many goddamn apps on my phone. I don't need another one. Yeah, I like these, man. Uh, that Atlanta one was the cream of the crop, but they're all good. Even that, even that dirty ass fucking Yankees hat's good. <laughs> Renaissance man finally said something funny. <laughs> Have you taken enough shots? 
Yeah. No, he, he just said Pierre missed a hat. Okay, boys, the nice note. Yeah, the world is ending. Yeah, you're probably right, Renaissance man. <laughs> These are great hats, so nice job, better gener the better generation. I, I'm paying attention now. I don't know about you guys, yeah. but I'm paying. Yeah. Let's move on to leaders out in Chicago. Just the reverse bourbon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These look like a hat. These look like the colorway from the hat I did. Yeah, it's but it's got the tiger the camo exact, under. Almost the exact yeah. same colors. But the tiger camo under. Yep. Yeah. You know what will make these look better? A stone under. <laughs> and a good head spin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. I like the Cubs. The the, like the unders Cubs. a little a little. I don't like the unders on these. I do like yeah. these hats, man. Obviously, but yeah. yeah. In hand, they're not as egregious as they look here. You got them. I got the Cubs one. Yeah, I think I picked up the Cubs. I think I don't remember. Mm -hmm. We'll find out. I in did. Three weeks. I did. It. I, I, I like. I like. Listen, this is one place where the under visor to me just doesn't work. Yeah, I do like these. I, I like the hat and then the under visor. You know, it's like uh, I'm not big on the shh, the White Sox logo choices of either. I'm kind of winged out. Yeah, and then uh, I I really don't like the All Star game patch like that. That's like a patch for being a patch. Like, listen, if these had a gray under on them, honestly. Like these would be great, man. Fantastic. Yeah. All right. Peach Maybe you did the ti tiger camo because it looks like peach cobbler. Maybe it looks like know. tiger I camo. I, uh, I don't know why I chose tiger camo. You know what's really weird? Look at the uh, under visor on the Chicago one to the right, the right side of the under visor. Isn't that weird? It's like a for sure. Floating side patch. I don't know where that came from. I know it's weird, right? It's like a fucking side patch in there. Oh yeah, yeah. It's weird. It's maybe how they cropped it, maybe. I don't know. Let's yeah. move on to lids, guys. Jason me doing all kinds of weird shit when he's doing these things now. I was I was in a hurry this afternoon. <laughs> so these were uh, three three like M. These? Do you guys like these? No. No. If I, the hat if the hat was black, these would be really good. I think. Um, it's not the camo that's bothering me. What's bothering you? Uh, the three M. Yeah, the UV. I don't mind having what a three M. What kind of thread is that? Sh what kind of thread is the logo? What is it's that? Like, it's like a like gray. Ball. It's like a gray. I think. Yeah. I don't know if the front logo is three M though. I think only the under. It might be three M material. I think it is reflective material. Yeah, it looks like a oh, might be then. like a reflective thread. Okay, so maybe, Not maybe, real. yeah, maybe the front and the side patch is 3M. I mean, if you're if you're one of those joggers that don't want to get hit by a car, but then almost want to get hit by a car by having camo on, like this is a perfect hat for you. Nah, man, these are bad hats, man. I think if these hats were black, they'd be pretty cool. I uh... think if these hats were black, they'd be black bad hats. Fair enough. Maybe I'm just like, like wanting to get a a, a reflective if, 3M hat. Maybe I don't know. If they were black, why do you? Why I send you one, Leah? Hmm? You don't want one. They're not. What, what are you? What are you going to do? Go out in the middle of the traffic and and direct traffic or or what? What do you need a 3M <laughs> reflective crossing hat guard from a yeah. new crossing guard job? That's or someone I don't know, but the. Uh, the uh, Tigers one that that's a bigger patch than usual, right? It's usually like a really small one. Yeah, that's a big ass patch. But I think like, listen, I think if these were black, the only the only thing that would be positive about it is that they can go with the Air Max ninety five volts. You know. Yeah. But, let's see. The is 90s. there another one of these? There is. All right, New Era cap. <laughs> The Guardians have landed. They have. So instead of a regular block C, you got a six point block C. <laughs> <laughs> I'm buying, I'm buying these, man. You are buying these? I don't. No, I'm not buying them, but oh. I, I don't mind. Nah, the, they just didn't. They just didn't 
spruce up the sea much at all. That's all. They crushed it a little bit. That's all. Okay. I'd probably pick up one in a gray bottom if, if given a chance, but right now it's a pass. I mean, they didn't have to change the C at all, if that's your point. I mean, I mean maybe they just want with... to feel different. I mean, those they... uh, those artists got no, to get the... paid, I guess, the ad agencies. The f- no, the font actually means something. It's got, like, incorporates part of the bridge or something into the, oh. the point. Boring. Two, two, bridge, two bridges. It's still on this Boring. bridge thing. Boring. Yeah, it's, it's definitely boring. in the bridge thing. And I can't, I cannot wait for the, the Guardians g flying g logo yeah the clip art logo yeah the ball logo yeah. yeah oh i can't wait to get my hands on that blacked out c look at that thing it screams uh clearance this this screams no, no one the, the white outline screams clearance yeah yeah they don't Both have any them. patches to go with these either <sighs> Such a like polarizing topic, like because people will like, you know, just love what they used to be, and then this is what they came up with. <laughs> All right, let's move on to the next uh, New Year cap slide. Right. Oh fuck, jeez, right. Man. And I didn't even bother putting the fucking SpongeBob restock on these slides. <laughs> Ay, 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 ay. Fucking New Era has teased, teased like two major drops this week and nothing. All right, guys, we got 148 people in here and uh, you're being subjected to the worst slide of the night. So we'd love it if you hit that like button for us. Let's get us closer to that 130 mark. Hit the like button for us, please. Please. It doesn't cost you anything. All you got to do is reach over and hit that little thumbs up. Right? All right. Let's hit that like button, everybody. We're going to go into our last slide. Cap USA Harlem just, out in Manhattan. Just new era, if you're listening, stop with the clip art embroidery. <laughs> Do fucking something. Yeah, we're available if you want to have us back at any point. God. Oh, that means we'd have to go. <laughs> I'll carry you on an iPad. <laughs> yeah, just, as long as you, you know, maybe put a hood on me and take me directly to the headquarters. I don't all right, guys, the polo grounds. That's that's you didn't get your candlestick park. Yeah. Okay, let me ask you a question. I'm See that expo, ex, I am my expo hat. hat. Mm-hmm. Yeah, expo hat. I featured, for, I, featured oh. I featured him on on the vlog that that we did when we went to Cap USA Harlem. He was at the end of the vlog. Who was the young man that put that together with uh, Cap USA? Ah. Uh. Would you rather buy that or save fifteen dollars and buy a bodega hat? Because that was one hundred and thirty-five dollars. The expos or the polo grounds? The expos. No, I buy the expos hat over a bodega hat. Oh, bodega! I, I thought you were. I thought you were making fun no, of no, that. No, 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 no. I'd I'd buy uh, the Harris tweed hat. Yeah. No, Braves, Mariners are really good. (laughs) Are we frozen? No, (laughs) I think we're just out of words. <laughs> Which doesn't happen that often, but you know, th- there's a market for everyone. Maybe the maybe the Expos hat looks good in person, but um, I like that Braves hat. Nah, the actual listen. I I like the Expos hat, man. I met the I'm I yeah. like the I, I liked it. I saw it in person. There's a video of it on on the vlog. I like the hat. Um, I, I, listen, I like Happy USA Harlem. They they do good stuff. I, I do. I. The Polo Grounds hat, I'm all set. I don't want nothing to do that thing. I think we've covered that already. But um, I don't know. They do good stuff, man. I and I, I I'm not personally gonna buy that Expos hat, mm-hmm. but there's a lot of people that will. Oh yeah. 
But for 135 bucks, it seems like that seems a high. Yeah. You guys ready to wrap this? Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. for the most exciting part of the day. Oh shit! Give me two seconds. I'm queuing Jason, <laughs> so I'm putting the code into the Discord. Um, Pierre made mention that uh, that he would be working on getting Discord drops. So this is not exactly a Discord drop, but we will be putting a 10% code off on this drop um, displayed in the announcement section of the Discord. So I'm just typing that up right now at everyone. 10% off. Pierre, do you want to queue it up? What we're doing? Yeah, so uh, you're talking about the hat that we're the 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 yeah. using the wall hats. Yeah, yeah. So we did small runs. Uh, some folks were asking for a restock and some of the uh, views in the vault hats. So what we did is uh, we did go ahead and um, and uh, release uh, three different colorways um, and maybe uh, maybe um, maybe uh, Leon, you can show those off. Yeah. Um, but you know that's that's what we. Um, that's what we have going for everybody, a little discount on them. Um, we just wanted to put together some hats because some folks were asking for them. Again, um, we know it takes a special a special person to want to wear uh, our likeness on a hat. But, again, we do have the hats um, available on our site. And if you go over to the Discord, there will be a 10% off coupon uh, to get your hat. Um, and, listen, you know, we love having you all as a fan base. Um, we're not looking to get rich off this stuff. We're just looking to reinvest some of the money um, into um, into. Uh, uh oh, so fresh is in here. <laughs> hmm? <laughs> so fresh. I think heard me talking about their hats. So uh, <laughs> I love it. So uh, you know, uh, just just um, just head on over there. Uh, we'd love it if you supported us and able to reinvest some money back into new cameras for Leon and Jason. Um, but uh, check out the Discord that's in there. Um, they're released and so fresh. I thank you for your sense of humor. We appreciate that as well. Um, and uh, and I think that's it, guys. Um, we're wrapped up now, right? Yeah. So, do you want me to show, show off what we're dropping? Or yeah, you can kind of go over it. You can take it, you can take it right. from here, Leon. I don't have to do all the talking, man. Yeah, you were yeah, yeah. before. So, so Rachel the... before, like that guy in the white, that that that. That cracker yeah. in the white hat is doing all the talking. So I was yeah, like, all right. Yeah, yeah. You know, Report, reporting talk. live from uh, Scarborough. So uh, breaking news, we have just dropped on viewsinthevault.com uh, three colorways of, of hats. The first colorway, um, we had to get Jason involved. Unfortunately, when we first submitted these hats, um, his lovely face was not in the new era system. We are working to get it in. Um, but the first colorway is an ode to Jason's favorite team, um, the Atlanta Braves. So... Um, that's my favorite. Oh, Leon, the giveaway too. Leon, you forgot to announce the giveaway winner. Oh, yeah, we'll do that too. Um, so Atlanta Braves colorway, Bruce on the Vault side patch, white guts, green under. Um, so that is the if you want to support um, us, but specifically Jason's fandom of his team, um, the Toronto Blue Jays version with the white panel, um, our old Jason favorite white panel hat. Um, in royal blue, oh, still, still favorite of mine. Still yeah, favorite. yeah. So again, all of them come with white guts, green bottom, reach from the vault side patch. Um, I am wearing the Boston version. Uh, we originally released um, the regular navy in the first run, but this is like kind of like the the old school Boston look. So there's that. Yeah. And for those and for those asking why is Jason not on there? Listen, just a little history of the show. If you haven't been watching for the past couple of years. Uh, Jason wasn't on the show originally. So when we first started the show, uh, it was just Leon and I, and I tapped uh, John from Ink Park uh, to create a logo for us. And that was, that's like the legacy. Um, that's like the legacy logo. So what we're going to be doing is I am working with, uh, working with uh, John from Ink Park to, to update the logo to include Jason. But remember Jason, uh, Jason wasn't, uh, uh, you know, it feels like he's one of the founding members now because he's been here for so long, but he wasn't, he originally was just Leon and I, and, uh, and we, at, we improved the show by adding Jason, obviously, but um, we'll work on the logo and we're going to change it, but it was just originally Leon and I. 
Um, and we wanted, and yeah. we also wanted the hats to stick, stick around for a little bit to make sure they're available for people. So throwing my face on there would have made them like fly off the shelf. So we slowed it down just a little bit for you guys. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> but uh, right, I got the winners. Stuff, I got the winners. Um, All right, and I want to I want to thank So Fresh. So So Fresh, you did donate nine ninety nine to the show, but I also want to thank you for your sense of humor. Um, it made me laugh, and uh, and I think um, you get it more than anybody. There will be people that reach out to me and say, I bought the hat from So Fresh and it's great. And they'll just do it to, to prove me wrong. And, you know, there's a saying, there's an old adage, right? That any publicity is good publicity. So, um, I, but I do appreciate your sense of humor. Uh, so Fresh, thank you so much. And, uh, and remember Leon, me, me, me and Leon like the Mariners hat. So, yeah. Yeah. Remember that. So Fresh. <laughs> yeah. Remember, um, I, I don't like either of your hats tonight, but I'm sure you're going to do better. So, uh, <laughs> Leon, what? So we got the new uh, the new winners here, or what? Yeah, yeah, we got the winners. So, um, well, what do they win? What is this again? This is the uh, friends and family. Yeah. Oh, I can show it. I can show it. Yeah, oh yeah. no, no, I don't. Have it. Damn it! No, I don't have it. They're they're downstairs. All right, no problem. So, <laughs> this cobbled together slide. Sorry, guys. Um, our five winners. Um, originally it was supposed to be three, but Pierre upped it to five because why not? Uh, congratulations to Yandro Caps, uh, Mr. Stay Humble, Brim, Brimmer. I believe that's Nano, right? And uh, JD yeah. the Ghost, number one. And uh, Iran Koto. Uh, please DM us um, on Instagram to collect your prize. Um, you will be getting one free VFTV. Um, uh friends and family uh gemmed out pin hold on i'm gonna get one i'm gonna get one yeah you cannot purchase these uh um you can only we we basically save them for friends and family of the show uh regular uh panelists and people who um, actually do work with us so i'm gonna show i'm gonna show what the pin looks like right here let's see if we can get a oh no it's hard because this thing is so damn shiny yeah blamed it out Dang. Let me show the other one too. That's still, guys. These are still up on the website right now. We still have some of these left. These are crazy, man. Yeah. Mm. Simply, we already picked the winner prior to the show. So, um, keep 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 trying. Maybe you'll win the next one. Yeah. No, nah, this is great, man. This is a great show, guys. Uh, as always, um, I loved all the participation from all the folks out there. That was fantastic. Um, we love doing this. Otherwise, we wouldn't be doing this. Um, this was great, guys. Uh, another great night. Um, I absolutely love this. And listen, um, if you guys uh, if you guys are uh, ready for more fun, come join us uh, every Friday at 930. Um, we're also going to have content throughout the week. And this week we're going to have a special a special um, video that that highlights a release from Sneaker Town. We won't get too deep into that yet, but you guys are going to love it, man. Um, and with that, Leon, big fella, take us away. Yeah, make sure you guys are visiting the Discord for uh, the 10% coupon uh, for the hats and hoodies that we just dropped. Um, and then that's uh, views from the vault.com for your official merchandise. Uh, for Jason, Leon, and Pierre, uh, we're signing out, guys. Stay fitted.